Hey guys, this is Chelsea. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Cool Plans. Um, today, if you are watching this video right now, it means that my husband and I have gone public with the fact that we are expecting a baby. Um, I'm so excited, but I bought this planner preemptively um, because I saw it when I was shopping and I knew, you know, starting a family was something that we, we wanted um, on our horizon. So I just wanted to share this planner with you guys because I think it's super, super cute. Um, I bought it at Aldi. I don't know how much that very, you know, Aldi's selection varies within the U.S., locally, etc. So it was under $10, which is, I think, a great value. And I just wanted to share it with you guys because I think it's really cute and I think it's going to be really functional also. So this says, a baby fills a place in your heart you never knew was empty planner for the mom to be the only thing that i've realized right away is that this coil stinks i know there's a name for this type of coil um but it just it bends really easily and it's been coming out of these so i don't know if that's something that i'm going to have to address in the future um it's by their pembroke band brand um and if I didn't mention it already, it was less than $10. So I just thought it was a great value and I'm excited to show you what's in it. So in the cover page, you do have a, um, a ruler that you can pull out, which I think is really, really great. Um, and then you have a, this planner belongs to some information in case your planner gets lost. And then you can mark your due date. Um, and then there's, you know, this congratulations page, wishing you good luck, best wishes. I like that you have this important context. So you've got um, obstetrician, midwife, doula, birthing center, lactation specialist, pediatrician. So you can use this really like early on in the child's life, as well as as you're going through pregnancy, which is really great. So... Here's a really cute intro page, how you found out you're pregnant. And so, um, you know, just kind of documenting when, where, and how I found out my reaction, how I told your dad and his reaction, whom we first told and when, and our families and parents' reaction. So I think that's really, really cute to like document the whole process. Then you have um, a couple pages to document, um, you know, my and my husband's story so a little bit about us as we're starting a family um just different things about our um about our relationship here's questions like when we knew we wanted a baby when we first started planning for a baby what we're most looking forward to what we're most nervous about so it'll be really interesting um then you've got photos of us and our family which i think is awesome and then you can create like a little family tree which is really really cute um you have a baby name brainstorming page which is awesome so my husband have been and i we've been talking about wanting kids um for we've been together for eight years and but we just got married last year but we had already had that talk of wanting to start a family and we've talked about like theoretical names and now i have a place to like capture it which is super super great so hopefully um, you know, when I become pregnant and when we, um, get closer, we can, we can just have a more formal way of tracking it and we'll remember what other names we were considering too. This is really cute. You can write letters to baby and they have one from mom and one from dad. I feel like, oh, I don't know. I told my husband, I was like, so there's this section in this planner and I want you to write in it even though it like, even if it's your mother made me do this, I can't wait to meet you, blah, blah, blah. I, I don't care. But I think it's really cute that they have this in here. Um, they have a countdown to baby, so you can count down your weeks, which I think is really cute. So once you find out your due date, you can, um, fill this all in. And then this, I really, really love. So by trimester milestones talks about your baby and what size they are, what organs are developing, and then what is happening in your body at that time in the different weeks. So 
Um, they have three different pages, you know, by trimester of everything that's going on. And that's something that I, when I was flipping through this planner in the store that I really, really love. Then there's a checklist by trimester, which is awesome. Um, and it kind of just gives you recommendations for what you should be doing early on in pregnancy. Well, it goes by trimester. Um, so that's really cool. Then you get 12 months of, um, and I'll just show you like each, each, what each monthly view has. So it's undated. There are stickers in the back that I'll show you that you can put on these tabs. Um, and there's a quote on every dashboard, which is really cute. So it's an undated monthly. It's a Sunday start, um, but you get five weeks in each month. You get some notes and then a little label here. And then these are what the weeks look like. So you can mark which week it is. Um, you can put whatever you want here in the days. And then ounces of water, how long you slept for, to do, how I'm feeling, memories or milestones, weight, belly size, cravings, aversions, other. So um, you get five weeks in this weekly version and then you get a notes page as well as you get a place to document your bump which is really really cute um and they give some they give some tips on um how to take your pictures possible date of conception i knew i was pregnant at this point yes for sure uh, maybe so you know just a way to document how you're feeling how you're looking all that kind of stuff super long to-do list page which I love and then another notes page so and then you get these really really cute um I guess really really beautiful and some cute but you know the changes in your body will last for nine months but the beauty of motherhood will embrace you for the rest of your life I think that's really beautiful um this is really cute, in my opinion. I don't know who you'll be, but I know you'll be my everything with the little onesie. So I'll just show you the dashboards. Um, oh, who is half me and half my love? Oh my gosh. Um, this one's about my body is full of life. My body is powerful. My body made me a mother. The next one is there is such a special sweetness in being able to participate in creation. That's very cool. Um, not every day of pregnancy is easy, but every day brings me closer to you. I am not afraid. I was born to do this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's so cool. Um, nine months preparing to fall in love for a lifetime. Of all the things my hands have held the best by far is you. Just when you think you know love, something little comes along just to remind you how big it really is. <laughs> there is no way to be a perfect mother, but a million ways to be a good one. So those are all the monthly sections. They all have the same format, but I just wanted to show you all the dashboards. So you get 12 full months in there, um, which I think is cool because you can kind of document some things about how you're doing early on, um, possibly, you know, postpartum. Then there's this, um, this info section. So you've got an info tab at the bottom and, um, prenatal doctor visit. So I really like this because it gives you an opportunity to, um, you know, questions to ask doctor, symptoms to discuss, doctor's name, date, week number, appointment, weight, blood pressure, mom's heart rate, baby's heart rate, medications and vitamins, next appointment, and notes. So you get several of these. And there are three per page, except for this first page, where it kind of gives you some more information on, like, what to expect on how frequent your visits will be. Um, so you get several of these appointment things. Then you get places to put your ultrasound. Um, you can write about what the ultrasound experience was like, how I felt when I saw you. Oh my gosh. Um, so these are really cute. You get two of those pages. And then preparing for birth. So you get some information about um, kind of how you, and I know nothing about this at this point, but um, 
birthing class I selected. Okay, so there's that. And then um, things to kind of document um, your birthing methods, things about that class that you're taking, your birth plan, um, which I think is kind of a nice way to like document everything that you want. So um, how you want your delivery to be, how what birthing positions you want to try like these are things that I've never even thought about um I would like my birth partner to be with me how I would prefer the room and environment um pain relief so you really get a lot of options to like think about um what you want um you know if it, basically like if this happens this is what I want immediately after birth, important pregnancy health info, background info. So I think this is a really great thing. I mean, you could, you can have this with you and bring it with you and, or, you know, make a copy for someone and say, look, this is what I really want before you're even in it and probably not thinking about all these things. Um, for the nurseries, you can do nursery planning, which is amazing. So colors, themes and styles, ideas and inspirations. You can kind of create like a vision board on these pages. And then um, nursery planning must have items to buy, favorite websites and stores and notes. You can sketch out layout ideas. And then you have these two pages of... Um, it's not dot grid. What is it? I want to say graph paper. Um, but anyway, you have these two pages that are just blank for you to sketch stuff out. A budget tracker, a registry checklist, which is awesome. Um, a baby shower checklist, which is nice. Um, have no idea how that's all going to go with the tra trajectory of COVID, but hopefully it's not a virtual shower. I don't know. Um, I had a virtual wedding shower and it would be nice to have an in-person baby shower, but we will see. Um, baby shower guest list, um, a gift list, which is super nice because then you can use that to write thank yous. Baby shower memories, so you can paste, you know, a bunch of pictures in here. A hospital bag checklist. Um, it's time who to call so people to call while in labor and people to call after baby is born i love that so so much welcome baby so you can put all different things about um uh, about you know the birth um and then a picture which is awesome home sweet home on our way home baby's first days baby's footprints the year you were born, so who's president, most popular TV shows, how much do all these things cost, national news, world news. Oh my gosh, I'm a little scared to like document some of those, but I think it is very cool. Milestones, immunizations, um, and then baby's doctor appointments, which I think is so cool. So now you have a place to put you know, those kinds of things. When What you had for yourself in prenatal care, now you have for your baby. Um, and then a daily care log, which I thought was cool. So um, the amount of time that you're feeding, um, just kind of like different checks. And then, you know, on the date, and then you've got, oh my gosh, all the different times. Um, other notes. Oh my gosh, so daily care log, you get two pages of that. Growth log, date, age, length, weight, height, and notes. Caregiver notes, so when you have a babysitter, you can ask them to fill this out. So who's the name of your caregiver? What's the date? Um, woke up at, last fed at, I slept well, okay, not well, I ate. Notes or special instructions. So you can leave these as references, um, but then places to record meals, what I ate and drank, how much, diaper changes, um, activities, naps, how was my mood today, and then notes. So I think that is awesome. Usernames and passwords for whatever websites, and then a whole but bunch of notes pages back here. You get one, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven. So, and they're double sided. And then you get a whole bunch of stickers, which is awesome. So here's the tabs for the months that I mentioned. Um, and then you just get a whole bunch of extras that you can use like in the monthly. Um, these are more decorative, but you've got like um, baby shower on the bottom, due date, arrival, um, and then you, but then you can also mark other life things like date night, lunch, meeting, um, and then there's, you know, these banners and other, other things. Are these like flags? Oh yeah, these are gigantic flag stickers. Um, so anyway, oh, oh, and there's a pocket back here. So there's a pocket and there's a protective sheet. So I think this planner is a great combination of like functional and, you know, biological, but also like memory keeping. So if you want to document how you're feeling throughout pregnancy and, you know, just have a good catch all thing for you to take with you to doctor's appointments, all that kind of stuff. I just thought this was an amazing resource. Um, the quality, you know, I mentioned the, the coil is really the only thing that I don't really like. But other than that, I am really excited to fill this out. You probably won't see this on my channel just because this will be more personal. But I still wanted to share it with you guys because I think it's a really great option. Um, I will be a new mom. This will be my first baby. Um, like I said, all theoretical at this point because we're... We're in the planning stages, but I still wanted to share this with you guys, and I hope you enjoy. Bye, guys.